G'day reefers, I'm Cam the Fish Guy. Thanks for watching Gallery Aquatica TV. So today, we're going to show you the first episode of our really exciting build, the SBS Mothership. So here it is, let's have a look and then we'll show you what we're going to do to start this system. So we've had this tank pretty much in storage for the last 12 months. And so today we're finally starting some work on it. We're gonna start by cleaning out a lot of this rubbish which is accumulated in here. Well, there's all sorts of rubbish in here. Uh, there was a screw. There's, actually, there's a few screws. And of course, because this is going to be an SBS reef tank, we need to make sure that there's no metal contamination. So I'm going to just do a bit of a sweep, get rid of everything that we don't want in here. Oh, it's a pencil. I'll need this in a minute. Today, our plans are really just to get this started and we're gonna start by looking at the board above us and hopefully start to space out the lighting that we're going to use. And we're gonna look at the, the plumbing. The, the drainage is currently just a single what I'm going to call, I think it's a 50 mil, might be 40. Um, I want to have at least two so that we can put as much water through this system as we want. And the next thing which I'm going to have to do, which is going to be the slowest, hardest part, I'm going to take this acrylic panel off the front using a blade to uh, take the silicon off and then we're going to silicon the panel back on. Uh, that's probably going to be a job for the next time we're here. But um, I'm just getting these things started for now. So, I'll cut this board. Better start with a tape measure. So we're going to trim off the excess wood to put on the shelf above the SBS mothership. So we'll start by doing this and then we'll screw the pieces in so that they're nice and secure. So now that we have a flush edge on this top beam, we need to secure the shelf to the beam so that we can put things up here and it doesn't move. So I'm just going to put a, two screws through on each panel up the top.
Okay, so we now have our shelf secured and um, we can screw our lights on from underneath and start looking at everything else. So I think we'll check out the plumbing next. So this is the original bulkhead that came with the, the tank. So I'm gonna pull this off and have a look at the size of the hole that it has. We'll probably use the same type of fitting, but we need to make sure that we've got the right size hole saw so we can cut our second hole for the second drainage line. That's really tight. No, I got it. Very long thread on these hands and fittings, but it's almost off. Okay, that's enough. So this is what we have to replicate. So I've never actually cut into fiberglass before. I'll have to do some research to find the best way. I was assuming I'd use a hole saw, but uh, I don't know. So I'll have one, we'll probably have the second one quite close, oh, maybe about there. That'll be our two holes. So the probably the hardest thing that we have to deal with with this whole system build is gonna be the fact that the acrylic panel has to come off before we can reseal it and put it back on. And it, I've started this previously, trying to pull this uh, uh, this panel off and it's really difficult. So I'm gonna give it another go today. Don't know how long it's gonna take, but I'm just gonna start by, wherever there's a space, I'm just gonna put a little bit of this uh, tubing as a space holder and then get my Stanley blade and continue to cut away at the silicon. So I'm already stuck with it. This is gonna take forever. So this is gonna take forever. Uh, I probably, the, the bottom panel was already, or the bottom section was already off the fiberglass and I've started on this side here and I've probably only done about 5% of this one side and it's taken me a good 20 minutes. So uh, I think that this is something I'll have to come back to tonight, maybe with a beer or two and uh, just take my time to slowly take it off. Um, and then we'll reseal it. We'll do the lights, uh, we'll do the plumbing, and uh, over here we've got the start of my favorite part, which is the aquascape. We've got a whole heap of real reef rock, and we've got a box of epoxy somewhere. So we'll use this and we'll do the scape. That's probably a couple of videos away before we get started on that. But at least we've made a start on the SBS mothership, and so far I'm feeling really good about it and I think this is gonna be one of the most exciting builds that we've ever done. So thanks for watching Gallery Aquatica TV. I'm Cam the Fish Guy and happy reefing. So that's our video for today. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button, hit the subscribe as well. We'll be putting out videos every week showing a, a new tank with new products. There's gonna be lots in all the videos. I'm Cam the Fish Guy and keep on reefing.